What's up everybody? Today we are cashing in the coins and I have saved up about one and a half coffee can worth of coins here. And these are all nickels, dimes, pennies and quarters. I know there's a lot in here. I like to use cash most times so when you use cash you have a lot of coins saved up and I like to save it up and every year and a half to two years or so go cash the coins in to see how much I've really saved. It's kind of like those apps now where they put your extra change round up the next dollar and put in a savings account but this is you know tangible here that I enjoy. Usually I fill up my car cup holder area with a bunch of change then when any more can't fit in I bring it inside and dump it into one of these coffee containers. Now comes the fun part, taking a guess, how much change do you think is here? Like I said, it's a mix of, you know, nickels, quarters, dimes. There's no um, dollar coins in here, just the four basic coins. Now this is pretty full. I mean, I could probably fit some more in there, but so I got a, a can and a half here. So go ahead and make your guess in the comments how much change you think is here and I will go to the bank use the coin counter and find out now here's a tip always go to a bank or a credit union if you don't have an account find someone who does and to use their change counter now they may have one like where I'm going out in the lobby area where you can it's a self-serve machine or they have them in the back and you can ask them to count your change for you whatever you do do not go to Coinstar at you know Kroger or the other grocery stores that may have a Coinstar. They take out a fee and I think it's like something insane, maybe like 10% or something fee just for counting your coins. And if you have $500 in coins, they're gonna take out $50. You don't want that. You've worked hard for your change and you're gonna keep it. You worked hard collecting all that and we're gonna keep it. So. All right, let's gather up our coins here and we will go. Wonder how much this weighs. Good thing I have a scale. So we're taking this full one here. We'll see how much this weighs on the scale. Uh, 19 pounds, 19.8 pounds. Now it's the weight of the can as well, but the can really doesn't weigh a whole bunch. And then this half one. Let's see what half one weighs. Yep, about uh, just under nine pounds. So if you were to guess what about 28 pounds worth of coins is, make your guess below. You know, it'd suck if I spilled these walking into the bank. last chance to make your guess below in the comments how much you think all of those coins were worth. I have to say this is the highest amount I've ever saved up in coins before. So if you watch the previous two coin videos I have made, check those out. So without further ado, this is how much was in there. We have 100, 200, 300, 320, 340, 345, 46, 47, 347 dollars. It's always fun seeing how much money you can get out of loose change you've been collecting over however long it's been. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next coin video. Probably in about, you know, two or three years, depending how long I collect this next amount of change for.